Hey, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, I'm Sarah. I'm an artist as well as a registered dietitian. One of the things that I love illustrating and painting is molecules. And throughout the month of November and December, molecules were the subject of my Huevember and Drawcember. And I have a stylized glucose molecule t-shirt design up on my shop. Huevember, I drew an ATP molecule, drawing it in different ways and in different colors. And then for Drawcember, I focused on vitamins. So these are all of the vitamins and illustrations that I did throughout December. And so I thought today, since I haven't dipped into my oil paints in a really long time and I'd been kind of craving that feeling, that buttery, delicious feeling of oil paints on a canvas, that we're going to paint today. And if you're here to see a finished product, that's not gonna happen. I am filming, editing, and posting this all in one day. And with oil paints, they take some time to dry. So what I'm gonna do is a glazing technique and I'm gonna do a thin coat so it will dry and I will be able to work on it over the next few days but you won't be able to see a finished piece today. So this is just kind of starting. And so I think I'm gonna stick with the vitamins for this painting and choose one to paint and I'll do a ball and stick model similar to what is already in existence. But yeah, so let's get into it. So I have my paints, I have this styrofoam thing that I'm gonna use as my palette. And then I have some walnut oil that we're cleaning my brush, my rags for wiping my brush clean and you know, touching up as I go. So I think I'm gonna do thiamine. So this is a thiamine molecule, just a ball and stick illustration that I did. This was Drawcember day two. And yeah, I think this will be our subject for today. So that's it. I'm going to potentially clean up the edges a little bit and then I'll probably be able to manipulate the paint for like another day or two and then I can do the next coat. And I'm gonna put some pictures on the screen of another painting that I did using this technique so you can kind of see how this is going to progress from here. Make sure to give this video a like and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!